Hello everyone, welcome to Bikami's YouTube channel. My name is Keja and I'm a natural bikini athlete. Today I will be teaching you some exercises for the perfect butt. But before that, please don't forget to subscribe to the Bikami's YouTube channel. So the first exercise that we'll be doing is the squat, which is considered to be one of the best exercises as it works out the entire body and not just the butt. So to do this, all you can do is imagine that you're about to sit in a chair. Then you stop, then you go up, stand straight, and then go down again, and repeat this for 12 repetitions and do three sets. So our second exercise is the lunge. You're gonna stand with your feet 12 inches apart, then you're gonna step forward with your right feet two to three feet away from your left foot. Lower your left leg until it's two to three inches away from the floor. Then slowly return to the starting position. Then do it on the other leg. For this one, you'll be doing 12 repetitions and three sets. And that's how you do a lunge. The third exercise that we'll be doing is called the kettlebell swing. You go down to a squat position with the kettlebell in between your legs. Then stand back up with the kettlebell in front of you, then go back down. Bend your knees a little and push your bottom or your butt a bit backwards. Remember that for the kettlebell swing, you do not use your arms, but you push your hips forward and that's where the force will come from. Don't forget that when you reach the apex, you have to squeeze your butt. We'll be doing 20 repetitions and that's how you do the kettlebell swing. Our fourth exercise is the straight leg glute brace. For this one, you get on all fours on a mat with hands under your shoulders and knees under your hips. Lift your right leg and squeeze the butt. Go back to the starting position and do the same to your left leg. Our final exercise is called the hip thrust. You have to set yourself up against a bench or a chair. Place your back against it, pressing through your heels and firing your glutes. Lift your hips off the floor. Your weight should rest on your heels and your upper back, not your toes or your neck and cervical spine. Extend your hips until they form a straight line with your knees and shoulders. Make sure the end range of motion comes from the hips, squeezing the glutes together at the top of the movement and not from your back. And that's how you do a hip thrust. It has been a great workout here in Gold's Gym the 30th. I hope you liked the video and don't forget to subscribe to Bikami's YouTube channel and my Instagram handle is cage.landicho. Again, this has been Cage Landicho and I hope to see you guys again. Bye!